Welcome to Jungle Jane's Southwest Adventure Series. Let's let the adventure begin. Hi everyone, I am really excited about today's topic and that topic is mimicry and my friend Barnaby here is going to help us understand this a little bit better. So mimicry comes from the word mimic which means the same. So animals who don't have a natural defense will try to be like other animals in the wild who do and that's usually handled in a couple different ways. The primary ways that we're going to explore here today are through actions, patterns, and colors. So we're gonna come over first and start with the rattlesnake. Now, the rattlesnake has something very specific that he does, and that is an action with a sound. You hear that? And it really raises the hairs on the back of your neck, right? So that sound tells predators to stay away. So something really cool that my friend Barnaby the corn snake does is he'll raise his tail up in the same manner and shake it. But he'll do that over loose gravel and leaves trying to emulate that sound and hopefully fake out some predators, which is actually a really cool thing to do. Now we're gonna look at some patterns and we're going to do this using some beautiful butterflies. Now one of these is poisonous and the other one's not. But looking at them, I would have no idea which one of them is actually dangerous, nor would their predators. And I think that's the point. All right, in examining color, this snake here before us could be the deadly fixed vein coral snake or the harmless mountain king snake. So I'm gonna give you a little rhyme to help you distinguish between the two. If we're looking at his color patterns, we'll see red next to yellow kills a fellow. And if we saw red next to black, that would be a friend of Jack. Looking at this color pattern, we would know that this is the deadly fixed fang coral snake, so we'd want to avoid him at all costs, although Barnaby doesn't seem to be bothered by it. So Jungle James, go out there and find us some cool mountain king snakes now that you know what to look for. Maybe he's going to try to mate with this thing. He might. 